All things are lawful unto me, but all things are not expedient. All things are lawful for me, but I will not be brought under the power of any. What? Know ye not that your body is the temple of the Holy Ghost who is in you, who ye have of God, and ye are not your own? For ye are bought with a price, therefore glorify God in your body, and in your spirit which are God's. 1 Corinthians 6 verse 12 19 to 20 Verse 12 is a strong message regarding the grace under which the believer stands. However, this grace message is often misunderstood by those that feel they must mix law with grace to somehow avoid doing wrong, or accomplish doing right. These verses explain what only grace can teach. Post-salvation, for believers and members of the body of Christ, the new creation, though it sounds crazy, all things are lawful. And key to understanding, this is what only grace can continue to teach. Not all things are expedient, and the believer should not be brought under the power of any other than God. So, grace teaches a believer to do only those things that are expedient. From the 1828 Webster Dictionary, we learn that expedient is literally hastening or urging forward, hence tending to promote the object proposed, fit or suitable for the purpose, proper under the circumstances. Further, grace teaches, Titus 2 verses 11 to 12, the believer to not be brought under the power of any, anybody or anything. Why? Because the believer is indwelt by the Holy Spirit of God, and as a result the believer is not their own possession. Rather, the believer is the possession of God, bought with a great price, the sacrifice of the Son of God, so that both our spirits and even our bodies should exist only to glorify God. Grace teaches us that we belong to God, to use our all things liberty accordingly, and only be under the power of Him to whom we belong. Believer, live in grace.